heading out of the room now to go explore Jumbo House some. Oh, uh, oh. so let's go explore guys, come on. Here's the arcade. Oh, we're spending more money in here. Oh, they have high security. This is the arcade and Jumbo House. It's loud. There's um, some different kind of games in here than at the Pop Century too, so that's pretty cool. Uh, I think now we're headed down to the Mara, which is the quick service restaurant here to kind of look around and see what they have, because we're a little hungry. Got a little snack area over here. Ooh, wine. Some more little snacks, like grab and go snacks. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Candy bar brownie. Chocolate chip cookie. Croissant. This looks really good. Look at this cookie. The sugar cookie looks great. And look I at the little butter brownie. Look at Damien though. Oh wow, this looks really good. This is the menu. They have hummus and pita all beef hot dog, barbecue pork sandwich, carved turkey sandwich. They just have a little bit of everything. They have flatbreads, burgers, and I am very hungry so I think I'm going to get a pepperoni flatbread. That sounds good. We haven't had pizza this whole trip. We got our food here. I got the burger which looks amazing and they have a little condiments bar over here where you can get tomatoes, onions, pickles, lettuce, everything. And then Dad and I got the burger and Mom got the pepperoni flatbread which looks really good. This is always already so much easier than the Pop Century um, food cafe area just because it's so crowded. This one's so easy. You had a little table tracker number that buzzed when your food was ready. Whew. I see why it's a deluxe resort. These burgers and french fries are not the same ones you get in the park. This burger is like so good. The bread's toasted. The fries are like thicker fries. They're still the hand cut, but they're thicker. It's so good, guys. I'm about to chow down. So we finished up lunch, and it was really delicious, guys. The burger was excellent, and Mom liked her pizza. It was a little cheesy, but it's so good. Now we're exploring some more of the resort, and here's the pool. Hey mom, how tall did you say the water slide was? I think they said 16. That's the pool area. It's a pretty big pool too. Star Wars The Last Jedi is playing tonight. Oh, we're gonna be at the, oh, the luau. Star Wars The Last Jedi is playing in the movie Under the Stars tonight. We're going to be at the live out. You could probably catch the end of it, honestly, because it starts at 8.30. It's a long movie. This resort is literally stunning, guys. We are just so happy to be here. We got our drink, our refillable drink mugs, and it's going to be a good day here at Animal Kingdom Lodge. We're just going to hang out, relax, reflect on our trip, and probably hit the arcade and pool, and who knows what else through where the pool just was. This is Jico over here and Boma over here. Which I heard are two amazing restaurants here at the Animal Kingdom Lodge. And then Sanaa is at the Kalani Village building on the other side, the Deep okay. Sea building. This is the lobby. It's on technically the third floor. So we're here. So here's the lobby. Wait, no, we're here. This is the Jumbo House. We're here in this lobby. We're staying like over here. And then this is Kalani Village, which is the DVC area. We're gonna turn from the beautiful lobby into the marketplace area, which is like their gift shop here at Jumbo House. Oh, wow. Look at these. These are beautiful. This whole little area is just beautiful. Ooh, look at this sweatshirt. This sweatshirt is super cute. And I like this bag too. This is a good little park bag. 
Discover the magic. Let me see how much it is for you guys. It is $22.99, which isn't that bad. I mean, it's Disney. If you watch our video of our trip announcement, I'll link it up here in the corner in the eye. Click on the little card. But we have a new shelf upstairs where our bedrooms are that we're gonna start collecting stuff from our Disney trips to help us remember them. And so for this trip, we are getting this. Because this is the trip that we got surprised with the Animal Kingdom Lodge in the zebra building. And we, the first thing we saw outside of our Savannah view was zebras. So this is going to go on our shelf. And mom's getting a pen. Oh yeah, those are cute. And then I get a postcard. I started this last trip. I get a postcard from every trip. So I'm getting this one to help us remember Animal Kingdom Lodge. So yeah, that's what we're getting. Let's have our feet kicked up. We're sitting by the little fire right here. Oh, your legs don't reach. <laughs> little legs. I can move. I can move forward. But yeah, Dad was just outside, out there on the Savannah lookout, and he was talking to the safari guide, kind of. Let me get some better lighting. He was talking to the safari guide, and they're so knowledgeable. He was telling Dad all this stuff about the animals out there and about the grounds out there. So be sure to ask the people around Animal Kingdom Lodge because they have so much information for everything. But as for now, we are relaxing. Guys, so we just got back from exploring and we come back to this. The, the safari is literally outside of our window. <laughs> Guys, look at all of the animals oh, right I'm here. The watering hole's right there, and I think that's the best spot to be. The watering hole? Oh my god, how many more? <laughs> There's so many. <laughs> I feel like Evan Almighty. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, this is better than the safari. Like, they're all right there. What? Basically, Animal Kingdom Lodge is a must-do. Another one of our, the Woe Disney's must-do. Because where else yeah, can you roll out of bed and see this? So we hope you guys enjoyed our Animal Kingdom Lodge Jumbo House room tour and resort tour. It's so beautiful here, guys. You have to come check it out if you can. Even if just for a night, that's what we're doing. Just for a night, come check it out because it's so relaxing. And just beautiful. Bye, guys.